What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Darkness Falls back here with another Punishing Ray Raven video. So, yeah, man, we're here to talk about the uh fourth anniversary PV here. So, we're just going to be reacting to it now. I did um uh, look at it when it first came out live on somebody else's uh live stream, so I did um see it as soon as it dropped, and we were right watching uh Rex Lynch uh video. So he was able to go in there and translate a couple things for us because you guys know I don't know Chinese or anything like that. So, yeah, man, um, you know, it's good things to be excited about. And also there are some other things, you know, some people may not be excited about. So we're going to watch the PV and basically go over everything. So I do got it muted. That way it's no copyright or anything. I know they have some new music and things going on. And lately I know Vanguard has been getting um, you know, more and more popular. So they have been copywriting a lot of songs these days so i, I don't want to fool with that so let's go ahead and start the pv band and you know just you know talk about what we got really here man it's in this package so of course we got the new s frank attacker q who who has came out and of course she's gonna be ice now her ultimate is very very dope and uh, i do like the character but she also comes with a sfx skin instead of a standard one so this one is gonna cost you and, um, you know, we got a lot of other things teased. Now, this PV is not going to go over everything. It's not going to go over things that are coming in this patch. But they did show us some future content of some future characters that's going to be coming to the game potentially. And um, I'm, I'm just going to name them. But if I want to make a full video about them, I, I'll do that later. But here's your girl Q here, man. Some people like to say Chu from, you know, in China. So, your girl here, man, dope. You guys know me. Like I told y'all in my last video, I love your girl Q. And, um, you know, I'm glad that she getting some representation here. So, not bad, not bad at all. Still got this uh, peacock pet. As you see, the throne, this thing is incorporated into her ult. She does some great combos. And then she... Falls up to the throne and sit on it. And then the ice wave come out from the, the beast. But yes, she's using the sword now. Like I told you guys, instead of the lance. So dope. I cannot wait for her. Now, another thing about this character. I know a lot of people was hoping that we got a break from Kuro. Been summoning like crazy every patch. You know, hopefully they was hoping this character was going to be free. Now, um, I already knew she wasn't, but, you know, I just had high hopes to see. Hopefully, they would chill. There's the ultimate right there, um, but they, they ain't stopping. So, we do have an SFX coding for your girl Vera, and she also is getting her leap. So, it's going to make her a little more useful on her lightning team. Uh, some other characters have gotten leaps before to prolong their usage. So, it's good that she's getting her 21, you see here. Has an FZ coding as well. So most of these, you know, are, are going to be paid. Now, the only free one we're getting is going to be your boy Not this year. Because as you guys know, he is an A rank. So Vera's and 21's is going to cost along with uh, Q's outfit. This is her outfit right here. And she used like this. Uh, it's like dark ice. So if you like this dark aesthetic, no, that's for you. I think it's okay, but... Uh, I prefer her original outfit. I'm pretty sure I'll get another outfit for her later on down the line. I don't, I don't like that one really. Vera outfit I like, but I don't, I don't think I want to invest in the outfit for her yet. Got a lot of different events going on. Here's the leap uh, right here. You can see she does a special, and then she does that part right there. Yeah, so do do need to have them uh, triple S for that. Just different part of the uh, stage. Different parts of the areas we're going to be um, exploring. But yeah, man. Here she is in all her glory. But we'll just leave it there. So I did have a notepad here. I'm just going to go over. Where is it? Here we go. No, no, no. Not these. Where are you hiking? Here. Here with everything that's, that's going on here in the patch. 
Now, courtesy of your boy, uh, Mont Yaiba, I'm not sure how he um, collaborated all this. I know but people he probably talked to or just gathered from Billy Billy or whatever, but I'm going to go over this um, this thing here. Or matter of fact, I'll just keep it here. It don't matter. As a matter of fact, y'all yeah, can see it. I don't, I don't care about this. Had other notepads, but ignore those. So as you guys know, man, you know, we got a new Ani Frame Q. They did tease your boy Wang Shi. That's the dude you guys know who went like that. Sleeping thing on his face with the gun. He's the ice healer. Teddy, she's an A-rank, uh, potentially. Uh, Luna, we've seen a new teaser, teaser for Luna. And we also had a teaser with a butterfly person that you know, we didn't really know much about. So just know uh, we got, you know, some some units coming. Now, new coding. Like I said, that's the one we just seen, the little witch looking coding. We just seen Virus. We just seen the Pharaoh Scent. You know, that's the 21. Then we also seen Noxus. But you guys see Vera coding is gotcha. So that one's going to be crazy. Um, I'm like, yeah, I, I don't know. Then we got Lamia. She got an outfit as well. Uh, it's more of a greenish white mermaid outfit. It's okay. Bianca got a new code in T's. Hers look very dope. I got to see that in game. Alpha got a new uh, new outfit. You know, Crimson Weave. Her outfit, I got to pick up. It's a must pick up. And uh, Wang Shi, he did get a, like, I would say like a gentleman looking outfit. It was basic. So it is what it is. So it says new memory for Q, Hanning, Vero 21, and Noctis. Uh, we did get some codes. So I already used these. But, you know, my face is in the way, I believe. Move myself down. But, you know, these are the current codes right here. Yes, I don't know if... Um, you use these before or have not, you know, it is what it is. But, um, yeah, new animation, of course, with Q, we got a new boss, King. He's a big old guy that uses like a, a lance, and he also has a chariot. <laughs> and then miscellaneous, we already talked about a leap system. We do get a new lobby background. It says anniversary 100% rate up banner up to Lamia. Fourth anti exclusive avatar, stronghold revamp. Uh, Norman, I'm not sure what that means, revamp, but it's something. Dorm exploration receives all button. Serum limit has been increased to 240. Free temples. Rerun some codings. You know, some old codings will be back. And they reset the, the 2x top up. So that means, um, I don't know if you ever bought like rainbow tickets or rainbow cards or whatever, or black cards or whatever. You know, if they had like a, you buy it, you get double. So that's basically what the 2x is. But yeah, that's like I said, this list was compiled. On uh, my Yaba's uh, my, my Yaba's community page on YouTube. So I'm, like I guess I'm not sure who, um, you know, he collaborated with to get this list. But I do appreciate everybody who uh contributed. I don't need that anymore. But yeah, man, a uh, lot of stuff coming. Like I said, uh, sucks that the character is not free. Like I said, I summoned on Watanabe. I summoned on Black Rock Shooter. I summoned on Lamio. I'm like, man, at least give us a free copy. You know what I mean? I, I, I can deal with that. So I know that, that has been a hot topic about it. You know, some people are saying don't don't expect nothing free. You know, me, I didn't. But, you know, I just was hoping. You no, know, you know, that's all you could do. But, you know, it is what it is. So nevertheless, when the character comes out, I'm going to be pulling for it. So you guys know me, man. Hopefully I get, you know, a copy or so. Mainly probably one copy. And then I'll just grind her up. But between that, if the patch people are predicting, maybe if it's long enough, uh, we could have some more time to um, get more of the character. So we'll, we'll see how long the uh, patch lasts. But yeah, man, I appreciate everybody coming out. Like I said, we do have more things about PGR. Like I said, for different videos we can come out with as we get more uh, news from Kuro Game. So appreciate everybody once again. Like I said, fourth anniversary hype. Tell me how you liked it in the comments. You know, are you happy with what you saw? Are you be something for Q? I know some people who are on global, you know, you got a long way to go, but I'm pretty sure, you know, this could be hype for you. You could be saving for your girl. So like, comment, subscribe. Catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.